Hi, I'm Mona, and if you're here, you found Kaleidoscope Dreams Tarot. This is your extra, extra read all about it for December 25th, 2020. I would like to say, please do not live your life by the tarot. It is you who creates your own destiny. You are intelligent, beautiful or handsome, and you are kind. These readings may or may not resonate. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. Someone may be enlightened by them. Also, to my subscribers, welcome back. And to any new subscribers, welcome to the channel. I'm so glad you're here. You are the backbone to this channel, and I greatly appreciate you. So, yeah, extra, extra, read all about it for December 25th, 2020. Let's all go ahead and get started, see what kind of involvement we have here today. <clears throat> This is for December 25th, 2020, December 25th, 2020, December 25th, 2020, December 25th, 2020, okay. Let's see what we got here. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> So, we do have, somebody could have received or will be receiving this, uh, some sort of nice pendant or gemstone of some sort, you know, as a gift for the holidays. Happy holiday, everyone. Also, somebody may enjoy uh, football. Mm-hmm. Got some football fans out there. Um, some may be attending church for the holidays. Right. Uh, we could have also some of uh, uh, active duty coming home for the holidays also. Okay, I got put these right over here. <clears throat> now we also have uh, some people that may just you know be keeping in touch for the holidays because you know we can't really move around too much, so there might be a lot of you know phone conversations. Also, uh, we're going to have to be careful out there for uh, home fires, I'm feeling, uh, you know, the Christmas lights. Yeah, especially with the weather being erratic like this and Christmas lights out there and shocks occurring and stuff. You never know. So make sure you keep an eye out for that kind of stuff. Also, could have some people doing some yoga, some indoor activities in the cold weather, right? Um... Most likely you're at a six feet distant or something, right? <laughs> we also have uh, some art lovers here. Okay. Some people that like art. Go like going to art shows, like showing art, like seeing art, likes art. <clears throat> All right. So uh, those things might resonate with some of you out there. If they do, this story could be for you. So uh, let's find out. What do we have here for the general energy for this extra, extra? Read all about it. This is for the general collective for December 25th, 2020. General collective's energy is... <clears throat> all right. We got the Page of Rods. Now, you know, this is a messenger... This is about somebody, you know, sending out a message of passion. This is also an individual who may want to go on some sort of new adventure, right? And that's what the message of passion might be. Hey, I want to go and, you know, experience this adventure with you or something, you know, <laughs> something like that, right? Somebody is definitely sending out a message or maybe they are going to go on an adventure to get to you one or the other uh, a message is the energy right what kind of message so let's find out what is really going on here right for this extra extra real about it for december 25th 2020 all right okay we have the lovers the three of swords and we have the king of cups in the reverse Mm. What else do we have here? What else do we have here? Whoa. 
Am I holding the cards upside down? I am. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what's happening here. All right. So we got the Ace of Swords. We got the Seven of Pentacles. We got the Three of Rods. And we got the Ace of Cups. And we got the Ten of Pentacles. So it appears, you know, there's definitely some defensiveness going on here, right? There's some defensiveness. Somebody may be um, speaking their truth and having to defend their own, you know, reality of what they really want in life. Um, we have this here, the lovers starting out. We have two people who, who love each other, right? But there's a third party interference in this situation. Now, one of the people here in this third party is the King of Cups. All right. It's the King of Cups in the reverse, though. Now, this guy is usually very, you know, he's very emotional. Um, doesn't really wear his heart on his sleeve, uh, but he is emotional, right? Caring individual. Now, with him in the reverse, he might be overly emotional. He might be even openly, you know, very open with his emotions. Because before, you know, the King of Cups doesn't really show. It has a kind of tough guy exterior. But, you know, deep down inside, he's a big old softy, right? This guy, I don't know about him, right? Uh, this guy... He may show like he has a lot of emotions and stuff. But they might not be genuine. You know? Like he knows how to work it. He knows how to work the ladies. He knows how to sweet talk, right? That could be the King of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. Don't focus too much on the signs because you could be confused. But... <clears throat> we do have this guy here, and he acts like that. And this could be a male or female. A female could be absolutely, like, showing all kinds of emotions, and I love you, and it's all a lie. You know what I'm saying? It's fake. So this is how the King of Cups is coming off right here. Like, it's not he's not real, right? And he has he uh or he's he's not real, but he's he's acting like he's being real. Sorry, Ugh. my words are getting all jumbled up. But but this person has definitely caused heartbreak uh, in regards to a lover or lovers. He could have actually been the one interfering with some lovers, or he could be one of these lovers. I you know, but there's a third party here, and he's one of them, right? That's what we know for sure right and we do have the ace of swords here and that that's about you know some but some truth coming in starting something new but you got to start with truth you got to be honest you know if you want to have a long standing good relationship everything has to be truthful right As, exactly from the beginning it has to be so it looks like this king of cups maybe either receiving some news or giving some news right and this news is either going to end a relationship for good or it might strengthen it it really depends on what's being you know said or what's going on here right because we don't we don't know exactly you might know exactly if it's your story and it's resonating. Right? Not everything on these readings are going to always resonate 100%. They might. I don't know. Because, you know, things can change at, 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 in, in a split second. Somebody could make an alternate move that was not supposed to be done. Possibly going against the universe right and then plans can be switched up completely because you know the universe works 
to the universe works so everything falls perfectly into place for those who are deserving of having some sort of, you know, reward or whatever. I don't know, you know, <laughs> you know, it's their time because they've been good, you know, and then somebody here could slip up mm. and that changes everything. You know what I mean? So that kind of energy going on here when it comes to that truth coming in. Now, this person who is heartbroken over a lover, right? Now, and you know what? What else? I think the King of Cups is heartbroken over a lover. And it might even be, the third party might be somebody, it might not be um, another romantic situation. It might be a family member. It could be alcohol or drugs. It could be an addiction. Anything that's holding this person back from being with his lover is heartbreak. Somebody's going to real, you know, he's going to realize some truth, though, about something here. Because he has really tried to plant some seeds of intention, and it's like, they're, I don't know. He sees them there. They're ready to plug. It's ready to go, but he's not doing it. Look. It's like, don't those look like they're ready? They're ready. Pluck them. They're ready. But he's not. He's not. He's just like looking at them. They're they're ready. They're ripe. They're ready to go, and it's like he it's like he wants to, but he just can't. Maybe he's afraid if he does, he'll get in trouble or something. I don't know. I don't like that guy's face. He looks so sad. I don't like it. Look. Yeah, I don't like that face. I don't like his face either. It's like she's there. She loves him, but he's not there. He's not there. He's not really all there. He could be in another relationship with somebody and not very happy at all. You know? Can't get it to... Uh, oh, well. There you go. And, and, you know, you see the angel up there, too, looking down like, Hey, buddy, if you're not happy, get out of it. Because doesn't she look really needy? Like, come over here. I love you. I want to hug you. Like Elmira or something. You know, you guys know Elmira? From the cartoon the um gosh i can't even remember the name it's like uh looney tunes but different like the 80s style of uh not as good as the original nothing is ever as good as the original right the original somebody here might be trying to compare something or a person to the their original person uh, the person they originally love right somebody might be comparing and may not be able to may not be able to compare no no one compares nothing compares i feel some stubbornness from that king of cups too definitely so he might not be making any moves, and he knows he can, but he's just not. And it could be, be there is a third-party interference here. Now, who that is or what that is, I don't know. Somebody could be waiting to do something with this third-party situation, though, because the front and center card is a three of rods. So this king of cups is waiting for something in regards to this third party. Now... If he's waiting for something, it could be so many things. He could be waiting for heartbreak to come because um, maybe he knows he's going to lose somebody or he's going through a situation that's going to cause heartbreak. Maybe he's going to cause some heartbreak in regards to this truth. 
Maybe he's going to find out about heartbreak and the truth. But he's waiting for something in regards to this heartbreak. This King of Cups is. And once that comes and the truth comes in, there's going to be new love for him. So this is a really weird situation. So he is waiting for some sort of heartbreak breaking situation to end. Right? And it could be in regards to, you know, like somebody in the family disagreeing, uh, an ex going through a, a relationship turmoil, whatever. This person is waiting for that heartbreaking situation to end. He's not plucking from it, I think, because... <clears throat> Um, there's something else involved. Look, okay, we got the Ten of Pentacles. We got the Ten of Pentacles, right? This is longevity. This is like, I love you forever. And it is. It really, really is. Like, you know, um, like when they, when you get married and this is involved and stuff, this is about, <clears throat> we're not going to get a divorce. We're going to always work it out. We're going to be good together. This is, we're a perfect match. You know, that's what this Ten of Pentacles is right we're gonna have something for our next generations because we work well together because we work things out because we are ten of pentacles we are longevity right that's what this energy is and it's, and it's falling right under this three of swords now this person may know that somebody's longevity may know that they're ready to speak to but for some reason they're waiting for something And they're very, they're trying to defend something also. <clears throat> what else do we have here for this extra, extra, read all about it. It's too many. Let me just put these down real quick. Oh, that's all I needed. Shoot. Okay, never mind. Look somebody just cannot sleep at night there's issues here there's issues with that heartbreaking situation definitely all right somebody will or will not receive justice here i don't know because you know we're not we're not letting these fly out they're all upright so uh, but i do see we have somebody that can't sleep at night possibly is trying to s solve some sort of problem here in regards to possibly a, uh, a a Libra or uh, a situation where uh, justice is or isn't to be had, right? I don't know. Now this has to do with somebody from the past. This is about, um, you know, reminiscing. This is about love. This is about love, a special love of somebody from the past. Now this person or somebody here was juggling. They were juggling somebody from the past and dealing with somebody currently, right? And they shared passions. They tried to possibly even create some sort of stability somewhere, right? But uh, something happened because now there's spying going on. Oh, it's because somebody walked away. Yeah. Somebody walked away. Now somebody's spying. But you can trust that they're going to be leaving a toxic situation to go to somewhere less toxic right that could be coming up you guys but for now somebody's just oh sad and depressed um, they want to make a move but they're waiting what are they waiting for okay that's what they're waiting for this person could have travel issues yes there is travel issues with this covid stuff going on somebody could be at a distance definitely somebody's vehicle could not be working somebody may not be able to travel because of the situation somebody may not have the money right somebody could be dealing with a cancer too i don't know because this is the card of cancer also so somebody is waiting uh for their somebody could be heartbroken that their car is busted up i mean you know what some of these guys with their cars, you you know, I swear. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like their their prized possessions. These people, these guys, you know. So you never know. But um, this person is is definitely feeling loved up. 
okay wanting love and wanting to speak the truth about love but this the forward movement is not happening it's not uh there's there's nowhere and, and you know what look we got the moon card could be dealing with the pisces but you know this person is waiting for something they're waiting for some sort of illusion right the moon is about secrets and illusion this person is waiting for a secret to occur a what secret i don't know or some illusion so this person might be in their head thinking oh this is gonna happen that's gonna happen it's gonna work out this way but that's an illusion this person could be even waiting for somebody to come rescue them that's an illusion especially if it's a man especially if it's a man man has to you know woman shouldn't be going rescuing man should they i don't know should they do they are they supposed to at one time i thought so you know some of you could be like me where you attract the, all these broken people and shit and then you feel like you can you can fix them and, and and some of them you do right some of them you do some of them you do help them then you realize you're not even happy there and then you separate right well then there's those ones that you can't fix who are all jacked up and then you feel like you failed right yeah and it's not even your fault <laughs> don't you hate that don't you guys hate that when that happens well at least we learned we can't fix everyone right right you guys we can't fix everyone but we can do we can hook ourselves up right we can fix ourselves everyone else well you know i think 2021 it's time for all those people who tried to fix all those broken people all of us who attract the broken people i think it's it's our year to uh that's coming up. I, I think it's our year to uh, fix ourselves, no? It sounds better to me. I'm going to try and do that. Look, I just saw 2222. <laughs> so I feel like kind of like 2021 might be that. The, you know, might be our time to uh, heal ourselves. You know? I don't know. That was just a thought. <clears throat> So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and see what comes out here. Well, let me see really quick. Did I, did I forget something here with this moon card? Oh, yeah. You know, this, this King of Cups, he's going to remain in heartbreak because he's waiting possibly for somebody to come and help him or save him or contact him and 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 if this is a, a, a if if the story resonates and you're like oh but that's that's a female okay and you're you're a male watching this then then yes you go and and you rescue the female right be her knight in shining armor but if you're if you're a, a, you know a female or if you're if, if if you're if this is a male a male right a male and you're resonating with this male and you're heartbroken because you're waiting for somebody to contact you that's an illusion person not going to contact you and if your car ain't working to go and go contact them or visit them or you don't know their number or how to contact them you better fix your car because that's the only way that this is going to get fixed this is the only way that you're going to have that longevity with the person that you love is if you get off your butt and go speak to them king of cups in reverse that's the only way this person's not gonna go to you you're the man dude you gotta do it <laughs> i'm sorry you're the man you do it trust by you just showing up that's like you're already 50 percent done just by you showing up shows like wow he's here you know like i can't believe it so 50 percent of the work is done 
Because you know you got to put in 100% on this one. Because you may have done something wrong here. And if you did, you know, how are you going to present the other 50%? It's just for that moment, just for this to start. Once it starts, then both put in equally and figure shit out from there. But to begin, you have to put in the 100% to show that you mean business here. I'm just saying. Sorry, this has turned into kind of a long one. <clears throat> Didn't mean for that to happen. Sorry, let me get a drink real quick. So, let's see what else comes out here. What else we got for this extra, extra? We all got it for December 25th, 2020. Extra, extra. I think that's all I need right there. Let me see. If I need more, I'll get more. So, starting out here, we got clarity of belief. Somebody may be clear about what's going on here, right? They know who their lover is. And even possibly believe that you all can get back together. They can get back together with whatever this lover is. But it's the third party. There's somebody There's somebody interfering here, which is making this person upset and sad that they can't even go after their true love. Mm -hmm. Somebody's being held back by somebody. Could be family. Success and growth. I have a feeling if you can get over this heartbreak, stop waiting for whatever you're waiting for, and just freaking move forward, you're going to have success and growth. Whoever is holding you back from your love, I'm going to tell you right now, King of Cups, if it's resonating with you, if you if this King of Cups resonates, King of Cups, King, King of Cups, I'm talking to you, listen. If you don't follow your heart, right, it's going to not only bring you extreme unhappiness, but it's going to also stunt success and growth for you. Stunt means it's going to prevent you from having it. And the reason why I'm saying this is because the guy is looking back at the clarity and belief card, looking at the heartbreak, and that is actually what is preventing you from uh, even moving forward in life. You may have not been able to move forward in life because you never have been able to follow your heart. King of Cups in reverse. That's why you're in the rever reverse. It's kind of like you're being forced to not use your heart. You're not allowed. Why? May have been focused on money, right? Maybe that's why. M-O-B, right? Money over bitches, right? Wrong. Because behind every successful man is a woman in the shadows his number one rooting him ho rooting him on the whole way or helping him or doing whatever but uh, somebody is not allowing you to have that king of cups and you're going along with it so you know but if you can clear that out, because I, I see here there's truth coming in. You might find out truth about that. You might be getting your truth from right here. You might figure out, oh my gosh, you're right. I haven't been able to follow my heart my whole life. And I haven't been able to succeed for some reason. Why? Because you can't follow your heart. 
the universe will allow success to those who follow their heart because once you do look at that look at where her hands are she's got her hands over her heart she's guarded but she can rebuild right she's gonna follow her heart her heart is just it's on fire her her heart chakra is lit up Build. She's balanced. You may find out some truth about somebody being really balanced and really in touch with their heart and love themselves. And you may want to go ahead towards that because maybe you want that for yourself too, King of Cups. Maybe somebody here is rebuilding. Look, 16 is a number, it reduces to number seven. That's Spirit's number. Seven, fourteen, fifteen. We got sixteen. Wait, wait, wait. Seven, 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 fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Six and one is seven. Yeah. This could be divinely guided by spirit himself or herself or whoever self, right? By the by the one. Embrace. Embrace. Embrace that you have finally figured this out. You may have found your truth here, King of Cups. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But somebody's going to embrace the truth. And they're going to get this Ten of Pentacles, this longevity. They're going to get it. They just have to they just have to pick the fruit you got to pick the fruit it's already ready to go it's it's ripe it's ready to be picked don't hold back from what you're what you are being rewarded with you may you may have planted these seeds and they're there and they're ready they're ready for you to pick and you're not picking them why It's that thing that's been holding you back your whole life. That thing that has pre been preventing you from following your heart, isn't it? It is. And it's time for you to make a choice, I think. Look. Look at that shit. I cannot even make this up. I feel like crying right now for you. Detach from that garbage and come home already. Right? You know this in your heart. You feel this, right? You want to go home. Falls right under the King of Cups. You're the one that needs to detach. Because you can rebuild. You can rebuild. Forget all whatever is there. Who gives a shit? Do you want to be, you know, having all this stuff and always being alone your whole life, never having real love? Or would you prefer to just leave all that shit behind, you know, empty pockets, whatever, and going after your love and rebuild brand new with that person to build that longevity because you know what longevity is right there i'm telling you it's right there with that person but you're not seeing it because somebody is blocking you from seeing it because they do not want you to follow your heart final card holy shit, you guys i can't even make this shit up That person, that person that you have your heart is hurt for, King of Cups, that person that you are, your heart is broken over because someone will not allow you to follow your heart. Guess who that is? It's the Empress. The one who will nurture you and to help you 34, 44, that might resonate with someone out there. I can't, 
can't even believe this. You gotta do it, King of Cups. You gotta do it, or you're gonna miss another one. How many have you missed from this person? How many opportunities for love have you missed because someone will not allow you to love? How many? I wish you wouldn't. I wish you would just follow your heart for once. At least. If this resonated with anyone, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Also, keep it true love energy, right? Happy, friendly, and loving types. We have nothing to fear because we stay calm and we stay cheerful, right? Mm -hmm. Also, January 1st, 2021, uh, Sacred Geometry Universe, my other channel, will be premiering. And I'm going to have a video diary over there, all right? Um, I don't know. I don't know what's going to be there. It's going to be random. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to give it a go. What the hey? I ain't got nothing to lose, right? Anyhow, I'm Mona. This is Kaleidoscope Dreams Tarot. And I'll speak to you guys next time. Bye.